Okay, Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. And hi everybody. Okay, so how are you? Hopefully you are doing well wherever you stay. Alright, so uh, as far as we are concerned, we need to to continue our lectures using on online approach. So we continue with topic moment about 3d for exist so last topic we we already discussed about moment about point so next is moment about exist so let's we discuss where is it here we are so moment about exist that one is not much difficult okay what the 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 thing that you must know is the formula moment about as is look at this one moment about as is equals to lambda as is dot and point so for example we, if we need to find moment about as is a to b from a to b so what is our formula m a b equals to lambda a b what is lambda lambda is basically basically unique vector from a to b remember unique vector from a to b dot with M A O M B. M A is moment about point A, and B is moment about point B. So, so this is our definition. So, moment of a force and as this is a scalar a scalar quantity due to the vector dot product operation. So, in a nutshell, so moment of a force about and as this is basis scalar. So, we have vector dot vector. Why vector? This is vector for lambda and this is vector for uh, moment about point. So vector dot vector equals to scalar. Scalar means that our final answer must be in the form of magnitude only. So look at this concept. Let's say we have P dot with Q operation. Then that one is basically same as we, if we have Q dot P. Not much different. All right. So vector resolve into unit vectors i, j, and k components corresponding to x, y, and z axis respectively. These axis are always 90 degree to each other and 0 degree with respect to themselves. Since cos 90 degree equals to 0 and cos 0 equals to 1, the dot products of unit vectors are i dot i equals to 1, j dot j equals to 1, and k dot k equals to 1 and then the rest must be zero okay look at this example <coughs> determine the moment of force vector f with magnitude 3000 newton about the axis a b so a b so means that from a to b so what is our moment about axis a b we have back to our formula we have lambda a b dot with m a or m b you can either choose from uh, moment about point A or moment about point B. Okay, so if we choose moment about point A, then what is our moment about point A? So we need to de define radius from A to C or A to D. So if we choose radius from A to C, then our moment about point A must be RAC cross with FCD equals also equals to lambda AB dot with RAD cross f c d this is moment about point if you choose point a and if you choose point b what we have we have lambda a b dot with r b c cross with f c d also equals to r b d cross with f c d so means that radius you can choose radius from b distant from b to c or from b to d okay you can either choose which one you prefer okay because the, at the end the answer must be the same okay so first step is try find lambda first so lambda is should be in the vector form so lambda a b x i plus lambda a b y j plus lambda a b z k so so what is our lambda a b x y and z so we can define distance from a to b first so the d a b x is 2.4 a b y is negative 2.4 a b z 
is 1.2 and D is 3.6. Uh, please, please don't forget the sign. Look at the direction of distance from A to B. So from here, we can actually find lambda AB in the, in, in the form of vector form. So our lambda AB is 2 over 3i minus 2 over 3j plus 1 over 3k. So next is FCD equals to lambda CD, isn't it? Because FCD is given in the form of res resultant, so we need to resolve it in the form of vector. So we, we can multiply it by lambda CD. So lambda CD from C to D, then this is our lambda then our FCD is for negative 400 Newton I minus 2000 Newton J plus 2200 Newton K. Okay, so next is look at this information. Vector R can be chosen from either RAC, RAD or RBC. Vector RBD should not be chosen as it is the hardest to use. So you can choose RAC, RAD or RBC. Or if you choose RB, then it's okay, no problem. But maybe your working step is more, much difficult or hardest to use. So let's say we choose RAC. So how to find MAB? MAB back to our formula, lambda AB dot with RAC cross with F. See, this one is basically moment about point A. So just cross product radius cross with force then we have this moment about point all right point a. then just if done once we have we already have moment about point a then we can dot with lambda a b then our answer is for five one two zero newton meter okay as i mentioned before the final answer of moment about as it should be in the magnitude so why because this one is dot product i dot i equals to 1 i dot j is 0 i dot k is 0 same thing here j dot i is 0 j dot j equals to 1 and j dot k equals to 0 k dot i is 0 k dot j is 0 and k dot k is 1 then we just have this value then our answer is 5120 Newton meter. And if you choose another distance, let's say RAD, RBC, or RBD, you can actually have the, 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 the same answer at the end of this step. All right. Okay, so that is it. So that is our topic moment about as is. That one is not much difficult. All right. So uh, I leave this video, all right, we end our video first and then our, ne our next video is I, we, 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 can, we can try solve together how to solve exercise 7.1 so just stay, and just stay tuned with my next video, alright, so thank you very much guys, Assalamualaikum